I'm going to type the APN settings on this uh, phone, it's a uh, cool pal row from T-Mobile and it uh, has to be unlocked either T-Mobile or at and in order to work on cellular stuff, okay? You're going to go to settings and then you're going to go to more and then cellular networks, okay, cellular networks and then you're gonna go to access point names okay and on this side you're gonna open a new APN on this model you, you see as a plus symbol so just hit that one and open a new APN other phones you need to go to the right top corner of the screen touching the three dots and it will be able to open a new window other phones you need to go to the menu at the bottom and open new APN okay so you're gonna touch the plus symbol and you're gonna see the uh, name Okay, so I'm gonna try to focus uh, better. Why well, you gonna go on the right uh, first place? You're gonna be the APN name, okay? And right there, you're gonna type the following: Cellular South. So Cellular with the C capital, okay? E L L U L A R. Then space S capital O U T H, okay? hit OK to save it and then uh, APN type or APN name uh, we're gonna set to the same cellular sound so C capital E L L U L A R space uh, S capital O U T H and then hit OK to save it and then uh, so you're gonna leave in blank the proxy port uh, username is in blank password uh, so password you can type uh, this uh, symbol okay the star okay a star just leave it like that and then a uh, server is to set to a start also a star symbol and hit OK and then MMSC, we're gonna edit that for the picture message. We're gonna enter the following address. It's HTTP column slash slash and then PIX, P Peter IX dot cellular C U L L U L A R S and then three dots one two three and then the letter O M the letter O M okay that's the and then you're gonna put a slash and then the word S E R B as a victor So R B as a victor and then L E T S servlets. Okay, without the E after servlets like that. And then another slash and then M M S. That's the address for the uh, multimedia. So just hit OK to save it. Uh, M M S proxies set in blank. MMS port is in blank. Uh, MCC is at 311. So if you are able to edit this one, please uh, delete 310 and enter 311. Okay. Hit OK. And then MNSC uh, is uh, 23. So you're going to delete 260. Enter 23. Okay. 23. Hit OK. On these two, on your phone, if you're not able to edit it, don't worry about it, just leave the values that they are. But if you're able to edit it, just delete those values and enter the new ones that we went through right now. Okay, so now we are going to... Authentication type is leaving blank or as it is. Uh, APN type, uh, we're going to leave it like that for now, okay? After saving this uh, APN. If you're not able to access to the internet, please come back on the same steps 
and just uh, edit the APM type and enter internet MMS so internet comma MMS all together just separate with the comma okay so internet MMS and just hit OK to save it okay so like I said uh, this one you can uh, after if you're not able to access the internet or picture message just come back and enter these values on the APN type okay I'm gonna leave it like that for now so once we finish everything just go on the right top corner of the screen and uh, go to save in some phones you need to go to the bottom with the menu hit menu and then uh, uh, save option appears so just click save and um, <clears throat> there is a problem with my phone that it didn't save the APN but if that is the case with your phone also just come back and retype everything else as we went through and uh, uh, save it so uh, I have to go back and uh, retype the settings because it didn't save it somehow my phone has that problem so I hope that your phone is you won't have that problem with your phone okay so in your case uh, after you hit the save uh, that's gonna uh, return to this page which is uh, T-Mobile and uh, the tab is Cellular South so whenever you see the Cellular South APN just touch the circle to activate it okay and you should get the uh, 4G or uh, data signal on the type of your screen uh, and access to the internet reboot the phone if you're not able to access the internet just reboot the phone if after reboot the phone you're still not able to access to the internet uh, just go back and make sure uh, data roaming is on and uh, return to the settings Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and go to data usage or data networks or cellular networks and make sure that cellular data is on okay and after that uh, if you're still not able to access the internet then go back to settings and then go to more uh, and then cellular networks and then uh, under access point names you're gonna hit network operators okay so at this point is when you're gonna go to uh, re uh, register your sim card on the, on the south bell I mean cellular south uh, network so data service temporarily will be disconnected are you sure okay and then your phone will start searching networks around you okay and once uh, cellular south appear on your screen just select cellular south you're gonna see a message under your phone saying uh, register on network that means that everything is okay and is ready to go if you get a message saying that unable to register on network uh, just uh, there are some uh, things you may consider is that sim card slot might be defective and you may need to replace it second is uh, your IMEI number might be on blacklisted okay so sometimes uh, well, like nowadays at and uh, T-Mobile and any other GSM companies they start blocking their IMEIs when customer they didn't finish to pay off their phones uh, they uh, just report the phone as a lost or stolen and somebody else uh, found it or sold it as a used phone and then you're not able to activate it so even if you unlock the phone even you have hard reset it or whatever you won't be able to get the signal okay so make sure to call your provider sell, sell your GSM provider to verify the IMEI to make sure that everything is clean if the IMEI is clean that means that your SIM card slot might be effective okay so right now because I have a uh, ultra mobile SIM card on my phone it's as good you see ultra mobile T-Mobile t, -Mobile t but in your case you may see cellular south or T-Mobile t, -Mobile, t or any other company okay so once you see the uh, cellular sound, like I said, just touch it and we we'll start register on the on the network. Okay, so can connect to this network because it's AT&T, but you're gonna go to Ultra Mobile, which is the SIM card that it is on the phone, and register on network. So this is the message that I sent you. I, I told you that if you got that message, that means that everything is okay. Okay. All right. So we're gonna troubleshoot the uh, picture message. If you're not able to send picture message have somebody to send you one first okay and uh, after that if you still not able to send or receive picture message um, 
try to take a picture, picture, a, a picture and send it to your own phone number. So that means the phone number from cellular south attached to the SIM card on your phone. And now, and then you will be able to access to uh, activate the uh, picture message. So, so that's uh, some troubleshooting that uh, I hope you, it can help you to uh, make this uh, work on your phone. And if you have any other questions, uh, please let me know on this phone. I have uh, on my channel I have videos on how to hard reset phones when the screen get blocked with uh, passcode, uh, pattern, or Google account. We, sometimes we forget the password. That's why uh, we create videos to using uh, the external buttons to delete those accounts. Okay. And also I have a videos on how to exit the talkback mode. Sometimes uh, we touch a folder and the phone talks or tells us what kind of folder we are touching. It's very, very helpful for some people. If you have any friends or relatives that are unable to see and they would like to use a phone, please help them out by going to my channel, find a talkback mode phones, um, and uh, turn the feature on or turn the feature off, okay, wherever you need. And, uh, Thanks so much for choosing my video in my channel and uh, if you have any other questions, please uh, leave it on comments. Thank you.